All right, this is a Akai LCXB26. Again, this is one of the older generation. Um, it's basically only basic functionality, RCA cables, DVI, and VGA. And here is your controls at the top. Again, I do not have a remote for this one. Um, the power for this guy is right here on the side. And here's a look at the front. And I'm going to go ahead and see if I can turn it on and uh, see what it looks like. All right, here is the unit plugged in. I'm going to see if it will turn on. And we'll see if it's working. Hopefully it will be. If not, uh, I'll possibly have to look at getting a lamp. Uh, looks like that's, that's not working. So it looks like I'm going to need a lamp for that. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at that. Right, here is the unit flipped on its top. And I've already loosened the area for the lamp. And as you can see, I do need a lamp. I forgot I took it out. Um, when it comes to lamps, um, my suggestion is if you're looking for lamps, uh, don't spend more than 40 to $50 on uh, you know older units like this. Um, you can usually get these units um, used you know, for, you know, not too much over $40, $50, maybe $100 at the most. Um, but these small ones, you can usually get the lamps. If you can get the lamp for around $20 or anywhere between $20 $30, it's okay. I would I would go for that. But anything above that, I'd much rather have a uh, replaced unit of the same type. If not, then go ahead and replace it with a better unit. Uh... But again, this one did not turn on because I forgot that I needed a lamp for this. But I still wanted to show it and uh, display it. And it's kind of uh, another one of the interesting ones that I have. I only have, uh, I only had like three of these, but I've given two away. So this is my last one.